not think that we have already thought of the best approach or, or even thought of the most important negative uh, consequences that could occur. I, I would agree completely with that. I think we might need to have all of them. Uh, in particular, we might want to have the, the, the widespread effect that you can get from stratospheric uh, aerosols where they're doing a, a, a very big area, which you might in hi-fi terms describe as a woofer. And you might also want to have a tweeter, which is the, the local... Um, uh, effect we can get from treating clouds locally, which you might call a tweeter. Now, we might have the, the Arctic ice to recover, we might have a particular coral reef, perhaps the Great Australian Bar Barrier Reef, where we focus particular amounts of cooling uh, in one particular sea area so that the water that flows from there keeps the coral. Um, that there are, at the moment, however, I would be very hesitant to attack any scheme that I didn't know a great deal more about than, than, I, than, uh, than I do now. Could you just amend my statement that I would also fund the kind of work that Klaus Lackner is doing, but I would fund it out of a carbon capture and storage program because I wouldn't consider it climate engineering. Last word to you, Professor Lackner. I, I would emphasize the carbon capture and storage, including the air capture, and I would advise against large-scale experiments until we really understand how it works. We are embarking on something mankind might do over the next 200 years, but I doubt that we really understand what we're doing yet. Okay, and Professor, uh, sorry, Dr. Paul? Well, I, I think uh, all the solutions that people might want to look at, it's very important to look at all of the consequences of, the, of any solution that people might come up with, so I wouldn't advocate anything in particular, but it is important to try and work out what those unintended consequences might be so that we are in the best position to make decisions. And, and on, on that note of uh, unanimity, could we thank very much indeed Professor Klaus Lackner from Columbia University. Thank you for joining us this afternoon. It's been a pleasure uh, to have you on the video link. Uh, to, to thank Professor uh, Ken Caldera from the Carnegie Institution. Thank you very, very much indeed for coming to see us this afternoon. We very much appreciate it. To Professor uh, Stephen Salter, the University of Edinburgh, thank you very much indeed, uh, Professor Salter. And last but my name is Dr. Vicky Pope from the Met Office. We're in, in your debt uh, for joining us today. Order, order. Portcullis House, Line 3, the Thatcher Room.